So I have two phones here. These are both Samsung phones and I'll be showing you how to transfer files which could be photos and videos and other types of files from one Samsung phone to another. And we're going to be using a feature called QuickShare which is almost like AirDrop but for Samsung, okay? So make sure we're going to send files from this phone to this phone. So what you need to do on this phone, the receiving phone, is make sure uh, QuickShare is enabled and this phone can actually find you. So what you need to do is go into settings and then go to connected devices, tap on that and then select QuickShare and then under no, uh, nearby sharing, who can share with you. When it's set to no one, it basically means uh, QuickShare is disabled and no one can try to send you files. So what you need to do is tap on that and then either select contacts only if this person has saved you in their Samsung contacts or you can set it to anyone nearby. So anyone nearby with a Samsung phone can try to send you files. So with that enabled, you can now go to the sending phone and find the files. Maybe let's for instance, select a couple of photos and videos. So that's a video, that's a photo, that's another photo. Let's go ahead and select a couple of slow-mo videos here and there. Now, once you select the file or files that you want to share, simply tap on the share icon. And then you should see the option for quick share. Okay. Now, if you have that contact saved, then you can find them in the contacts. But generally, you want to go to quick share. Tap on quick share. And it's going to start looking for devices around. Now, this is a Galaxy A14. And as you can see, this Galaxy A14 has been detected. So what you need to do is tap on that. And it's going to ask if you want to convert video so that it's compatible with the recipient's phone. Go ahead and tap on that. And allow it to do its thing. And then once it's ready, you should see a prompt on the other phone asking you that uh, this Galaxy S23 Ultra wants to share five files with you. Okay. And there's going to be a pin there. So... If you want to accept, you can either accept or decline. If you don't want the files, simply tap on decline. If you want to accept the files, tap on accept. And the files are going to be sent. Now, sometimes you might be required to enter a PIN, especially if it's, if it's the first time that you're sending files from this phone to this phone, you might be required to enter a PIN. But since uh, we've done this before, you can see five files received from the Galaxy S23. And here are the files, okay? You can access them from anywhere. In the gallery, you can go to albums and find the QuickShare album. And all the photos you received via QuickShare are going to be saved in a special album in your gallery, okay? And that's basically how to send large files from one phone to another using QuickShare on Samsung phones. Thanks for watching. Leave your comments and questions down below and good luck.